Hello, this is Guy that King of 52 with. Sorry, tonight. If you watch the Daily, the, uh, the Daily Show with John Stewart, the Colbert Report, they're pretty funny shows. One particular <laughs> clip for the Daily Show caught my attention, and it's rather funny. I want to play it. I'm going to turn the volume up. Okay, we play. Be one if you're easily offended by this kind of stuff. I was just not watch it. Connect to the one home. Come on. The one community. If you're easily offended by gross stuff and dark humor, then don't watch it. But if you're not, uh, it's, it's pretty interesting. At Century 21. The show is pretty funny. Here it is. Meanwhile, Berkeley, California, the city that invented free love, may soon become the capital of moderately priced love, thanks to a November ballot initiative that would effectively decriminalize prostitution. Meanwhile, upstate in Sacramento, Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger recently signed a law, I kid you not, banning necrophilia, <laughs> a.k.a. sex with corpses. So, in Berkeley, you can sleep with a hooker, but if you kill her, <laughs> the party's over. <laughs> the new... The new law which makes... Uh, that saddens me for all of you. <laughs> the new law which makes necrophilia punishable by up to eight years in prison, or two years if it's just under the shirt, over the bra, <laughs> came about after a San Francisco man was found naked and passed out on top of a dead person's body. <laughs> Authorities couldn't prosecute the man because he wasn't breaking any laws, though he was presumably breaking the record for worst beer goggles ever. <laughs> One law school professor said, quote, Prosecutors didn't have anything to charge these people with other than breaking and entering, but if they worked in a mortuary in the first place, prosecutors couldn't even charge them with that. In a related story, season five of Six Feet Under just wrote itself. Uh, as disgusting as necrophilia is, even John Stewart manages to make it funny. So yeah, you know, just takes comedian, comedian talents. <laughs> Which was really weird, because, you know, you think. <laughs> that saddens me for all of you. <laughs> oh my god, that is just funny shit. for the worst beer goggles ever. <laughs> Billy's got his beer goggles on. <laughs> now he's in deep shit with a po-po. Oh no. <laughs> it's like, Billy, how drunk were you when you got your beer goggles on? That's just horrible. <laughs> It was on uh, episode nine oh thirty-three, which was episode September sixteenth, two thousand four. Hmm. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> 